as businesses start bringing more employees back to work, concern has now shifted from COVID safety to public safety. And that is where former NYPD Chief of Department Terrence Monahan will play a, call, will play a role. CBS 2's Sandra Grimes has more. Terrence Monahan walks a different kind of beat these days. You're not getting those phone calls in the middle of the night anymore. The retired NYPD chief of department traded in his police uniform for a suit and tie and a new office at the city's Department of Small Business Services. What is your exact title right now? I'm a senior advisor for COVID recovery safety planning. And what does that entail? What does this job entail? What do we do to make businesses feel comfortable? to come back to New York. How do we get tourists back to New York? Monahan says at this point, most companies and businesses feel like they have their protocols in place to keep employees healthy. But now their concern is public safety. Workers say the city has a big job. Obviously, I have to reduce the crime a lot, or at least the perception of crime. It looks like the crack era. So they can do more. I don't know what they do to address mental health. Do you get stories about the homeless? Do you get stories about uh, the increase in crime? All of that is exactly what Monahan hopes to combat. He started at the end of March, meeting mostly on Zoom with corporations and businesses across the city. The point person to help cut through the bureaucracy and resolve problems that are stopping people from returning. For this city to recover, people need to feel safe when they come into the city. And it's my role to make sure every city agency is working together to provide that level of safety and I advise the mayor on what's going on and what needs to be done. So what is the difference between this and what the police commissioner has to do? I'm working with every city agency. I'm working with DHS for homeless. I'm working with Department of Consumer and Worker Protection when we deal with the vending issues. We put together a team that sits together weekly. City agencies have to know that uh, if there's a problem, we're going to try and address it. Monahan says perhaps the biggest concern he hears is about safety on the subways. He says he worked with the MTA and the NYPD to get more officers assigned in the system. And in Times Square, where a handful of recent shootings made international headlines, part of a spike in shootings across the city. Monahan says a big part of his job is not only dealing with crime, but the perception of crime. Last year was a tough year. Shootings went up, doubled. Brought us back to 2010. Those are the numbers. These aren't the 80s and 90s. Monahan knows it's an uphill battle, but the Bronx native is an eternal optimist. You can feel the vibe in the city coming back. Truly believing the best is yet to come for the Big Apple. In Lower Manhattan, Andrea Grimes, CBS 2 News.